Hey, hey, people. Orange One here. A little reference there for those of you who are new to the channel coming from uh, Seth's <laughs> video um, on Caves of Cud. Yeah, uh, well, welcome. This is our, our character is pretty far on in the game. I would say he's mid to late game. Got some access to some cybernetics. Deep diving, um, axe wielding dude named Chip Chop. And he's kind of like a, I don't know, crazy axe dude, but he's also like a proper gentleman. I like to think of him that way. Um, we do have, yeah, no tribute points, just skill points, but we've got this place that we, we were clearing out. I want to possibly go to the, um, was it the rusted archways or whatever? Because I think you can get like a guaranteed... Um, cybernetic uh spawn there but there is also some down arrows or downstairs here what layer does this take us down to layer nine that's pretty far down there actually we could uh we should encounter some interesting enemies around here a voider oh take that greater voider oh they teleported me luckily nothing too bad some bones. There can be some good artifacts though on these bones sometimes. Uh, can I actually charge them? I can. Let's charge them. And can I then try and dismember? Yeah, take that. Voider. Uh, can I charge in two turns? Yep, go ahead, charge him. I can't dismember, but I could flurry. Nice. Can they, like, not teleport me anymore or something? Like, what's what's the, the deal here? There we go. He's dead. Greater Voider is down. Yeah, I mean, those are not that easy of enemies, to be fair. Like, that's actually pretty good that we managed to kill that. So easily. They got a lot of bones up here, man. They just grabbing things and oh no, teleporting them to holes that they can't then get out of. Are you kidding me? The voiders threw me in a hole that I can't escape. Well, I think we're gonna have to teleport out of here. <laughs> They've trapped me otherwise. <laughs> um That's a shame. I don't even know where I am to be honest. I don't want to go there, actually. Can I move that? I want to go to maybe our hometown. Yeah. Oh, what? Nothing happened? Hmm. That, that's weird. Let's try that again. I'm getting a little worried all of a sudden. There we go, that one worked. Okay, well, cool. Cool beans. We're we're here now. Anyone wanna trade? <laughs> They're all like asleep or something, I don't know. Who are you? Yeah, the bears do, they do have some good stuff, so I'll try and see if I can trade with some of them. Uh, there we go. Oh, I mean, I could just get like that to make myself a little, a little lighter, but I, I'm not really interested in that. I'm more of interested in getting actual loot, you know? But it looks like all the bears are like asleep or something. Yeah, I think that's what's going on. All gone to bed. <laughs> These bears, man. Okay, let's let's uh, let's get out of here. A little little bit of a, a dead start. At least we got out of being trapped in a hole by some teleporting spiders. That I mean, come on. Just like you know, Seth was saying, this game just like where does that happen in other games? I I got teleported. 
out of like reality and reappeared in a like some literal like crevice or something <laughs> like come on man kind of not cool game okay so here we're at the rusted archways this place we are way overpowered for i'm just not even gonna bother like fighting these guys i'm just gonna roll through honestly i don't even need to attack them you know but i will mostly because i feel bad for the dude um let's see where is it here we go i'm going down and i'm just gonna kill everything in here Jeez, uh... <laughs> There's a lot of enemies here. And they can't really hurt me. But the thing is, is I just don't want to have to micromanage all of them. Seems not very fun. <laughs> you know? It's just kind of... Loosen... Um... The demand on my CPU a little bit. <laughs> With all these things that are getting killed. And the floor that's getting ate by like acid by a skunk. <laughs> and that dude's like punching some sort of prickler quills or something. I don't know, man. Weird, weird stuff. Um, anyway down. There is cool. There's a way down, I would like to take it. Basically. Hello. Now, these pigs are pretty ruthless. No stairways leading down yet. Game. Yet. Nah, not, that's not even worth picking up. Are you kidding me? Okay, that's uh, the dead end. There has to be stairs down, though. I just... Yeah, here we go. I'd heard about this. This place. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's something. Something peculiar going on here. I'm getting ate by the acid. That's what's happening to me now. That's what's peculiar. Peculiar. <laughs> um, I mean, the nice thing is that they could eat through some walls by doing that. And then give me access to things that I shouldn't have access to. Yeah, I don't know. Nothing here. Okay. Let's keep on going down. And I've heard there's cybernetics in here. I want I want those robo parts. I want robo something. What? Excuse me, sir? What have you got there? An electro bow? Nice. Oh, I I had one of those on my previous character that I had on the channel. That that thing like was really good item for that character. I think we're kind of above it now skill-wise. Like we don't really need it. Yeah, why did that hermit throw a bomb at me? I just I I'm still kind of confused about what caused that to transpire cuz I didn't think I had aggroed on him. I do love those skunks, because they mess up things. Like the spawning of everything. Okay, another way down. Let's keep on going. Here we go, this is what I wanted. Yeah, I don't care. You guys are just so weak compared to me. Good luck trying to fight. Um, I'm gonna have to go in the tar. Can I... Uh, let's have a look at this. What is it? A kickback. Um, laymine, set bomb. Huh, okay. I'm, I'm not familiar with kickback, the skill itself, but it's saying it's something about laying a mine or something. I, I think I should be able to look at the skills and understand what's going on. Because I know the laying the mine is um, this, right? 
but that's not what's what it's saying, is it? No, it's it's some sort of skill called kickback. Oh what? Oh, um, something called between zero and fifty points. So it's just a random thing called kickback. What is kickback? Is it uh, is that the gun skill that lets you? I think I assume kick enemies back, right? I want to say I I recognize this skill, but I think it's from this, right? Yeah, yeah, dude. That whenever you fire a two-handed weapon, that's that's not half bad. I think that I might install that actually. Welcome, aristocrat. Install the kickback skill. Um, yeah. We'll replace inflatable. Nope, actually, hold on. Can. If I. Wait, hold on. If I try to install inflatable axons. No. Okay, so it looks like inflatable axons or kickback. I can't have both. Well, that's a shame. Well, a real shame there. But what's what's this? What's this we have here? There's something here. Um. Ooh, pneumatic pistons. Ah, uh, that sounds interesting. Oh, what? <laughs> Jump increased by four spaces? That's... I want that. Definitely. I want that. <laughs> you kidding me? <laughs> okay, so check this out. We can now jump... No, hold on. H... How far I could? What? Did you just see that? Did you just see how far I jumped there? Holy cow! Holy cow! Okay, and that takes like sixty-five to cool down. Okay, well we just apparently became a frog man or something. I don't know. That's that's what I'm gonna call it. Okay, we're famished. Let's actually cook ourselves a little something then. Um, I don't know if we're inspired to cook anything special, but if we are, let's go with boar jerky as well. Sure. Nah, nothing special. Seriously, we're gonna be able to like jump like super far now. It's it's kind of bonkers. Um, did I just step on, I think, a... There's, nah. Oh, these things are, this is what I, the dead, dead roots, those can be really good. Ooh, Cybernex Wedge worth three? Are you kidding me? Okay, this is turned into a very worthwhile trip very quickly. Can I upgrade myself? Um... Please. Okay, um, insufficient credits. Cool. I don't really care. <laughs> as long as you let me install what I want. Um, if I look at these, does it give me any history? No. It's just like statues of people who have been implanted. I feel like that's like from like the business that used to like run this, you know? Like it's like they're like ads or something and we're like looking at it like it's a holy relic, you know? Right? Isn't that like how what's going on here? I know, I could jump at these, those enemies so quickly if I really wanted to. Right? Can I? leave through the door if I'm attacking that. No. Don't penetrate. It says I'm cleaving it though. I'm, I'm doing a little damage. If I do that, 
How how's it doing over there? It's still fine. Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna do that. That's that seems like annoying. <laughs> you know. But if I can get yeah dreadroot tuber, and then as soon as I get dreadroot tu tubers, guess what I can do now? I can make salve injectors, which. If you've been watching this, that's like one of the best things that you can get, honestly. One of the best items. Um, okay, I think that we may have exhausted this location of of loot, possibly. I and mean, I can I can do my incredible jumping skills. Voila, look at that. I know. I'm gonna have to wait though if I wanted to not get Tari. I don't really mind that much. Okay. Um, there you go. That's how you get some easy cybernetics in the game. Is the rusted archways? It's it's not that hard to take care of it that way. <laughs> and I mean, as you can see, I'm pretty high level. But the enemies here, they're they're not like humanoid or anything. Pretty easy stuff. Um, now the question is, is there any historical sites? EMS, I've already been to. I don't know of any other historical sites or lairs. Yeah, I think that I've already been to. And that, yeah. There's nothing special, special around here, really. Um, let's just go back to... Up here then. Go to the ruins and, and see if we can find something in, in said ruins. I mean, I know I'm carrying around a lot of loot actually. Maybe we should just take a minute and just... Oh. There's... A chance that there could be some good stuff around here with all these turrets. They can be guarding some pretty good stuff. And then, like, check this out. No one is safe. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! There's just something fun about, like, jumping across the map like that. Like, honestly, it feels like I'm jumping across the map. Okay, Puma. Um, juke up next to this dude. Yep, thank you. I think I am going to teleport to somewhere and see if we can do some... I forgot that we have the point defense drone. I haven't even used that, like, at all. Can we teleport anywhere? I mean, I think that maybe we want to do some trading at our home village if it'll let me. I think maybe our solar cell just didn't have enough charge last time that we tried to do that. Is that? That's a special one. This is our hometown, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. This place, there's the Tinker and the um, Dromad and a couple other people. You can get some good stuff from these guys, honestly. Uh, motorized treads, that's why I give him a Force Bracelet. If I could get that, I'm, I'm going to get that if I can. Yes, absolutely. Force places are like, seriously, like, oh my gosh, such a good item. Um, I have some sort of missile weapon that is unknown to me. I should probably figure out what that is. I feel like that kickback's not worth it. Um, there's probably other stuff that I have. Yeah, like, look at all this. Yeah, I don't need any of that. Don't need that. Oh, that's worth a lot. Um, that is worth a whole lot, actually. I might just trade that and then see what else I can get on top of this. Because we're getting a good good uh, haul there. Um, the visage is too much. What else have you got here, friend? Uh, the bounding boots can't wear those. I don't know. I don't know if there's anything else I really want. Maybe I should just hold on to more of my stuff. Yeah, hold on. 
I'm holding on to these. Friend. Yep. Good trading. Um, oh, what? What just happened there? Are you... why? What's going on? I feel like he got very upset about the pathing there or something. Please tell me you're not attacking someone, Tinkerer. I, I didn't see where the Tinkerer went. Okay, whatever. Dramat, um, actually, before I trade with you, what's this missile weapon that I'm carrying around? Oh, it's a slender electro bow. Okay. Um, what have you got here? You got a, some sort of yeah, it's probably a grenade. I really don't care much for the grenade. Okay. Yeah. All right. Nothing really here in the hometown. Uh, and we didn't really trade that much with the bears, but. Do we need to? This is the next question, you know? Oh, hold on. Where's that, that thing that we just bought? The force bracelet. Yes. Learn that. Oh, no. I don't have Tinker 2. Can I get Tinker 2? What do I need for Tinker 2? I guess we'll be holding on to that until I can get Tinker 2 because that, seriously, if I can get that, is such a good item. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. We're not intelligent enough. <laughs> Dang. Oh no, I don't know if our character will be intelligent enough to do that. Okay, well, we got a really cool item if I can ever get intelligent enough. I don't think without the right cybernetics that's gonna happen though. Which is a sad thing to say. <laughs> Growth mindset, man. You can do this. <laughs> right. Um. Yeah, let's maybe do some more diving. I think instead of shopping, let's do some more diving. I think though to do that, let's maybe teleport to the... Uh, we'll, we'll do a little more shopping because it's right by wherever we want to go. Inventory. Yeah, it's, I, I wish there was a better way of quick traveling besides going through the inventory like this. It's just kind of annoying. You know? Okay, here we go. Yeah, I, I will check the trader just because he's so easy to check because this one cannot move. It's a plant. <laughs> so, nice. Um, we could get another combustion cell. That is kind of tempting. Besides, I have already so many. Uh, what's the small trinket in there? I'm kind of curious about that other energy cell that's in there. More than the one that I already have. How much value do I have of stuff right now? Electro bow. Um, okay. Yeah, we could we could make this work. We could swing this, definitely. Yeah, let's do it. Sure. I'm I'm not really interested in the recorder, but I'm just interested more in what the energy cell is that you've got there. Please don't break it. <laughs> and where's the energy cell now? Yeah, I think that this has been a pretty chill, chill episode, actually. Um, can, oh, no, it would be in the artifact. Yeah, right here. It needs... Oh, is this the acid one? Yep, it's the acid one. Okay, cool. Well, when we're fighting acid enemies, they'll be basically giving me free power, so that'd be, that's fine by me. Um, there are these ruins over here that I kind of wanted to get to. Of course, I got lost on the way. Oh, check this out, dude. Right, I'm not going to jump to you. I'm just going to let you get closer and charge you. I should be able to charge further. I feel like that would make sense. Oh, wait, I could, you know, I could do. Check this out. Oh, you're not safe up over there, dude. <laughs> <laughs> he's like I'm gonna throw my grenades and then this dude just like 
jumps across the tar pit. Oh no, his friend though. I'm not going to be able to do that for another 72 turns. <laughs> I kind of want to do it again though, just because it was so awesome. I'm taking that. Yeah. Yeah, um, I'm just going to maybe hook and drag you. Yeah, we'll just take these dudes out, and then if the other guy shows up, we'll take him out. Yeah, look, we can get Elastine from these guys. That's, like, really good, and, like, Carbide, that's, like, not half bad trading item, honestly. Um, where's the sower? Can I jump? I cannot. Not yet, really. Okay. Ah. Okay, uh, charge, not quite. Um... Now there we go. Yeah, we can't we can't get the jump on you, but still mess you up something royal. <laughs> I will definitely take the grenades though. I'll definitely take those grenades. And you know what? I think we're lost, so we gotta kind of keep on going on foot. But. Yeah, do those dudes even give me any experience? I don't think they do. Um, should I jump this dude? No, let's not jump him. Let's charge him. How did he not even get a grenade off at me? It's kind of crazy. Okay, there might be... Uh, something kind of weird happening here. <laughs> Let's kill the goat folk and just get away from that whatever is going on over there. I think interdimensional things. Things I don't want to mess with, basically. <laughs> As a true kid, I would imagine that Chip Chop knows not to mess with interdimensional things. <laughs> Um, yeah, uh, who can drag you kind of over here and see if I can kill you. I'm going to jump right on over to that sower though. Yeah, you thought you were safe again. <laughs> did I, did I do what I think I just did there? No, I did not decapitate. That would have been too cool. Too cool. Can't give me that, can you, game? I mean, we're still pretty cool with our, like, frog hop. Frog hop. Engage. <laughs> no, not, not quite. Frog hop. Engage. Nope. No. Yeah, these dudes, they really just get messed up by me at this point. It's its kind of sad to even watch them try. I i would like it if I could... Um, I still get a decent amount of experience from them, actually. I just realized. I wouldn't mind actually farming them a little bit. But at the same time, maybe I can do that off camera. I was hoping to get to the ruin. But... We'll see about that. Here we go. We're in some runes. And it's pretty much time for the episode to be done. <laughs> Can I just get in here? See what's going on. Watch I get, like, killed. Blow them off. Yeah, these dudes are pretty easy so far. Yeah, super easy enemies so far. Okay, so it's just like a regular rune. At, on the surface. Yeah, I thought there was a turret there somewhere. Yeah, this is going to be just a regular old ruin, it looks like. <laughs> Bummer. Well, this is, you know, Caves of Cud, if you're being a coward. 
<laughs> an overpowered coward. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. I think I'm going to end this here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.